Alright, hello. So I have uh, this random bug where my Unity doesn't want to open. No matter how many times I reinstall Unity or Unity Hub or restart my computer, the project just doesn't want to open. So what's really happening is uh, the Unity launcher, I guess, opens when I try to open the project, but then it closes out of nowhere. And then the Unity editor just never pops up, and so I can never access my project. And even if I go on my folders, files, and manually open the Unity editor from one of my projects, I just get some random licensing errors and it just doesn't work, everything's broken. And after a couple of days contacting with Unity, uh, they finally solved the issue. And this is what I'm going to try to show you right there. And before doing anything, uh, make sure that your Unity hub is closed. And even if you quit it right there, uh, just make sure it's closed on your Unity, well, on your Task Manager 2. So if you don't see any Unity, everything is closed. So what we're going to start with is open our uh, files. And we're going to go on our computer, go on program data, find Unity. And you should have a file right there. So what you're going to do is delete it. So basically what Unity figured out is there was a random licensing error with the Unity the new Unity Hub update and uh, so basically what we have to do to fix it is manually install our license with our command prompt. Then what you're going to do is go back on your computer, this time go on program files, go on Unity, Hub, Editor, go on whatever version you want, uh, it's going to be different for you probably, then go on Editor and you should find Unity.exe. So what you're going to do is copy the file location open your command prompt, put a quotation mark, paste, backslash, unity.exe, another quotation mark, and you're going to write is dash batch mode, dash, uh, create manual activation file, uh, dash lock file, press enter, and what you did is create a dot all file. Where to find it is basically where this is written, so your user that the command prompt is in. So you're gonna go and uh, you're gonna find user somewhere, users, you're gonna find the user, and you should find the .o file right there. You're gonna click on the link I put in the description, browse the file, so you're gonna go in your computer, find users, and the dot all file should be right there. You're gonna open it, press next, go on whatever license you have. If you have a pro, just enter your serial number, but I'm using the free version. So you're gonna press next. You're gonna download the license file now. Put it on your downloads just to like put things less complicated. And it should be downloaded. Uh, you should find it uh, right there, yes. So that's gonna be your file location. So open your commands prompt again, put the up arrow key and download all the way until batch mode. What we're going to write now is dash, sorry, we're going to write dash, uh, oh, manual uh, license file. And then put the location file, which is downloads backslash and write the file right there, which is unity underscore version 2020.x.0 dot dot and then write dash log file boom if nothing is written then that means everything works and there is no error and basically what you did right there is create your license and to make sure it works you're going to open your unity hub and you should find your license somewhere and boom my license is already there so it should work for me I'll be able to open my project even if I put 2020 before or 2019 it should work and uh, so my unity launcher is opening right now and boom my editor is actually open and everything works now if you're having any problems with uh, what I'm telling you right now you can just tell me in the comment section below or contact me through my discord it's gonna be in the description yeah happy creating